So Brett, you were just telling me a moment ago that you had made an observation regarding your dad. Yeah, I just, I, I, we were walking to dinner, I guess it was last night, or maybe it was yesterday afternoon, I don't know which, which way it was, but you know, one day later from, um, from the, the treatment, he just seemed to have a different walk to him. Now, I, I haven't noticed it again, but it was like, it wasn't the, the post, you know, walking like he's walking on two posts. Right. So it right. looked like he, he had a little more steadiness, and, but I'll, I'll keep observing that okay. and let you know, too. Okay, great. I, I'd appreciate that. That would be excellent. And you had mentioned Bill, the physical therapist. Could you elaborate a little bit on your experience with her? Oh, with your, with the lady I, I mm -hmm. saw last night? Probably as uh, astute a person as I've ever met. I mean, you know, and I'm not exaggerating. I'm this. I've been to several uh, um, physical therapists in my life, and this lady had me do more things than all three of them put together, wow. or the all of the other ones put together. I should Wonderful. say. Wonderful. And uh, for uh, good reason. Too. Yeah. And Wasn't nice, just giving you a bunch of exercises. Yeah. Nice lady. Uh, yeah. Explained everything just like your your company does, and I was never in the dark. She she. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I was pleasantly uh, surprised. I, what I thought was nice about her is that I watched her do the exercise with him. Every mm -hmm. one. She like laid down next to him or walked next to him. Mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. This oh, is how wonderful. I want you to do this. So. Super feedback. Thank you yeah. very much. You know, that. now, I didn't yeah. take any ibuprofen today, and I did yesterday. Mm -hmm. So... I don't want you to take all the credit yet, because some of yesterday said, <laughs> some of the Ivy Pro, you mean I didn't take it. getting larger. <laughs> you know, I mean, I still feel a little bit of twing. Okay. Uh, but, What's the uh, percent? I mean, considering it's two days, give me a percentage from where you were to where you are, what took place in the last two days? Uh, probably uh, 80% better. Okay. Uh, all right, my head's going to swell <laughs> yeah, a little bit. A little bit. One yeah. of the things that we do with our clientele in general is the belief system in this industry once you place the stimulation forward, if you don't give the body an opportunity to actually manufacture new pathways, you've missed an incredible opportunity. So that's one of the reasons we truly uh, believe that whether it's respiratory therapy, whether it's physical therapy, whether it's occupational therapy, whether it's behavioral therapy, we've used all those avenues immediately thereafter. Sure. I think it just makes sense. Well, it does make sense, and you have to, tra you have to, train, you have to train the body or retrain the body. Because uh, what what I mean, what I believe, as we were having this discussion, is about the body is made to repair itself. But if there's inhibitors, yeah, that's true. That's yeah, true. that's what you have to battle. And Bill, you had made a mention about energy. You thought there was a change. Yeah, you know, I well, I, maybe it's because I've been sitting on my rear here for four or five <laughs> days, but because I'm really a pretty active guy, and. Uh, but I've sat in the room and, because it's so damn hot outside, you know. But, I mean, we go down to the pool and have lunch every day and that kind of thing. But as far as being pretty active, I have not been. But, uh, I mean, I'm waking up at, uh, not going to bed. And usually at home I'm in bed by 9 or 9.30 and struggle getting out of bed at 6. And I'm waking up at 6 here, going to sleep at, at 10.30 or 11.00. And I, and I don't know, maybe, I don't know if it has anything to do with it or not, but it sure seems like I, I'm damn sure not tired, I'll put it that anything way. Anything else you'd like to share with us that was an experience that you think well, was Well, only in, and we put it in your, uh, in your fact-finding report that uh, I think Rudy has. But anyways, uh, Brett and I were talking this morning at breakfast, and, and one of the questions in there is, what could you guys do better? <laughs> and I'm not real sure there is anything that you can do better. Oh. Uh, and I don't mean to be blowing smoke, but every one of your people, I mean, from Miguel to the Dr. Uh, uh, the P, and, uh, and I mean, Charlie, Rudy, you, I mean, you can't be any more thorough than what you guys have been. And common, not common sense is not the word I want to use, but you spoke to us where we understood it. And I think Brett did, I did. And that's something you go and you get all these medical terms and all this stuff. Well, how do you walk out of there? You don't know anymore and you went in, you know. Right. But uh, I really mean that. I, uh, I would sure recommend uh, that somebody has a problem. That, and and you, you guys have been so honest with us. I mean, hey, if it's a problem that you're not going to be able to, to help, you aren't going to do it. And, and I, think I, I, I think I know that. Mm -hmm. So uh, 
when if somebody has a problem, they darn sure ought to uh, at least get in touch with you and see what your thoughts are because you've been so thorough. It's amazing. Well, thank to you. Me. Thank you very, very much. We we really appreciate your feedback. Mm -hmm. We truly super. Okay.